Hi, we are at LabCon and I'm with Tian from Paranoia, the LARP edition. Hi, Tian. Hello. Okay. Sure, a lot of people have heard of Paranoia, but yep. could you just give a rough overview of where of the Paranoia and how the, the LARP fits? Okay. I'll tell you that again, I completely <laughs> lost the tie there. You've been talking too much this weekend, haven't you? I, I haven't stopped talking, yeah. Okay. And one, and two, and three, four, five. Hi, we're at LabCon, and I'm here with Tian from Paranoia Lab. We're at Lab Edition of Paranoia. So, Tian, for those odd people who may not have heard of Paranoia or don't understand how Paranoia Lab might be, can you just give us a quick overview of, of, of the game? Yes, of course. Um, it's based on the actual roleplay yep. system. Um, so, we've taken the best bits from all the different systems, all yep. the different editions. Yeah. Um, and we've stripped it all down yep. and all away, so it's a very simple system. Okay. Um, but basically, for paranoia itself, yeah. um, everyone lives in Alpha Complex. Yep. It's a massive, sprawling complex. Yeah. Um, and it's run by Friend Computer, yeah. who loves you yes. and wants you to be safe and wants you to be healthy yep. and wants you to be happy. Lovely computer. And, and deviating from the health, the happiness, and the safety yeah. is treason. Yeah. And treason is punishable by death. Of course it should be. Because <laughs> <laughs> um, obviously you're faulty. Yeah. Um, basically, friend computer uh, clones you. Yeah. Uh, so you get a number of clones. Um, it's 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 not particularly a serious game. It's very yeah. slapstick. Very. Yeah. Um, <laughs> Very fast paced, you get through a lot of characters. A lot of characters, very fast. <laughs> very fast, yeah. yes. Um, but yeah, it's basically you start off as troubleshooters, yep. red level, and then you can move up the uh, rainbow. Yeah. Uh, and as you move up the rainbow, you're allowed to do more stuff. Yeah. So at red level, you can only interact with red and black things. Yeah. Uh, um, orange level, orange, red, black, black, yellow, and so on. And so, so, so. so um, and of course, interesting that the wrong colour is treason. It is indeed treason. Yeah. Um, uh, disrespecting anybody who is higher level than you. That's treason as well. Treason. Yeah. Um, not all of them are necessarily. Um, Death, yeah. treason. But you know, you get you get treason points and things yeah. like that. So there's there's things a bit around it. Um, and you basically you start off as troubleshooters, as red clearance, yeah. doing work for Fred Computer, hunting out mutants, yeah. uh, commies, yeah. um, and traitors. Yeah. Yeah. Even though every, even though they are living in a communist society, mm. um, communist are wrong. They've got commies. Commies are wrong. That's right. Because I might think that Fred Computer kind of had a strong 1950s lift to it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, it's very sort of Orwellian kind yeah. of, you know. You must do this. Frank yeah, Peter watches everything. So it's very dark, very black, but very funny. Yes, yeah. yeah. It's it's not sort of horror or anything like that. It's yeah. it's meant to be amusing. It's meant to be fast paced. And, yeah. um, it's also meant to be. It's PvP. Yeah. So we're expecting players to. Uh, accuse each other of treason, of, of killing each other. Sure, yeah. um, but if they want to kill each other, they've still got to fill forms out. Of course, yeah. Um, because it's a massive bureaucracy. Um, yeah, everything's form filling out, um, and then you hand it in, and someone puts it into the computer. Okay. Um, uh, computer takes a look at that. Yeah. Now you've, you've been planning this for a long time, haven't you? Yes, we have. <laughs> Yes, uh, 2014, I think we did it off well, first, our first playtest. Yeah. Um, we got permission from Mongoose itself. Okay, so this is fully licensed from Mongoose, yeah. Yeah. And Mongoose take the game over from West End, I think? Yeah. Or, yeah. yeah, they took it on from West End. Um, so we, we emailed them in 2014 and said, yeah. we'd like to do Paranoia Love. Yeah. Um, and their answer was, yes, don't make any money. And we were like, it's lot. It's lot. Um, <laughs> Are you kidding? <laughs> and if we want to come, we don't want to pay. Okay. <laughs> that was my answer. And I said, well, also, we wouldn't expect you to start at red level. Yeah. Because you own the game. Oh, yes. <laughs> you can start whatever level you want. Yeah. Um, so, yeah, they might be turning up, they might not. It depends okay, on the system. So, a couple of them might. Um, there's no promises, they've said, yeah. but, you know, if, they, if they've got the time off. Yeah. And so. the first game is this year? Yes, October 23rd to the 25th and at Grange Live. At Grange Live in, in Birmingham, yeah, yeah, which is a fantastic venue. Yeah. We've been there, it's, it's awesome. Oh, it's beautiful. Yeah, yeah, it's absolutely beautiful. We've got all three floors. Yeah. Um, so we've got dedicated mission space, we've got dedicated sleeping areas. Yeah. Um, so it's all portioned out. Oh, everything. that's fantastic. Um, it's 24-hour time in. Yep. 
So we time in at 8 o'clock on Friday and time out at 2 a.m. Sunday morning. Yep. Uh, sleeping's time-ish, um, yeah. but you can still go on. There will be missions at like 2 in the morning yeah. for anyone who wants to go on them, if they want to. If you want to go to 2 a.m., they, they can go up at 2 a.m. in the morning. Yeah, yeah. Fantastic. But well, I hope it all goes really well for you. Yeah, so do I. So do I. Thank you very much for that. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you for interviewing us. Thank you um, very much. And hopefully you can make it over and uh, come and have a look. We'd, lo we'd love to come over and have a look. You're more than welcome. I mean, the, the, the little secret is that I actually got a, a small connection to Paranoia. Yeah. I actually have one of the first scenarios for the original RPG published on White Dwarf years ago. Oh, nice. I really want to come. Yeah, I love Paranoia. I've, I've, yeah. I was, when I first read one of the Paranoia ones, I just fell in love with it. And yeah. Yeah, it's, it's yeah. been my dream to run this for a while. And it's just getting the right crew together and the right refs. Yeah. And um, so a lot of us have been ill recently, so it's taken a long time. Oh. So. Well, I think it's all goes brilliantly well. Hopefully, yes. Yeah. yeah, we're really psyched for it. We've got we've got a good crew on board. So, well, thanks so much, Em. Thank you. Thank, Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for watching the video. Uh, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and to ring the little bell to be notified when things come up. Uh, or why not pick one of these? Come on, just, just anyone. That one. That one. I, I'd go with that one. <laughs>